So I'm using my walk today to come out and do a little bit of foraging for, and it's everywhere at the moment, wild garlic, also known as ramsen, which is a delicious, um, a delicious wild edible and it is so abundant. The hills here near this river are just covered in it and every, you, you, you can't help but go out for a walk in the woodland this time of year and get that pungent hit of, of garlic in the air. It's simply delicious. And all of the plant is edible from the bulb to the flowers, the leaves. Uh, I'm just out collecting the leaves today because I want to make some pesto and it's a little early for the flowers so we'll just grab some leaves. I'm not going to get any bulbs or anything. And this is it, it's everywhere man. And uh, the, the flowers, when it, when it does flower, it comes out into some, into some lovely bright white flower. Not to be mistaken with the woodland anemone, or <laughs> that's the flower, the leaves are very different, but white flower, and it grows in and amongst it as well. Uh, also a bluebell, I'd watch out for that as well, because that can give you a bit of a dicky tummy. And it starts to shoot through at the same sort of time as well, so. You know, it goes without saying, just only pick and eat what you know 100% to be what you're wanting to pick and eat. Otherwise, you could end up KOing yourself. Uh, and in the current climate, it's probably, it's probably best not to get ill. So, forage with caution. Ah, beautiful. The smell. I'll eat it, mate. I'm up. I'm on Quarantina Turner on my Todd, aren't I, so it doesn't matter if we stink of garlic. In fact, what I'm going to do with these, I'm going to collect a bag, or I'm going to collect a few handfuls, and then I'm going to go and make a dish that's going to be garlic upon garlic. It's going to be so garlic, I'm going to use loads of it. <laughs> the smells! Let's just dunk feet, feet in first. Bah, she's cord. She's, oh. she's cord. Right, I'm going in. Right, that's coming off as well. Weird bank like. It's like an under, an underbank. Chris underbank. Woo! Refreshing, can't feel me, knob. Refreshing. Oh. <laughs> right, how am I going to get out? Uh, okay. There's no elegant way to do this, is there? Or is there? I'm slipping. I can't, I can't get out. <laughs> I can't get out. Still a bit cold, mate. Woo! Right, let's get a cup of tea on. There's a train, look! <laughs> hey up, hey up, hey up there! <laughs> well, why not? In these times of war, it's nice to have one wind column for underpants, mate, for, for speedoids. That's good. Beautiful, oh, beautiful. Oh, we might as well have a brew here, shall we? We might as well have a little brew here. Right, top tip for lighting your trangia instead of, you know, risking risking burning your knuckles. Yeah, just dip a stick in there. Get the stick going. And then into your, into your fuel burner, and that's it. You often can't see it burning, but that's it on fire now.
I'm gonna send off this green tea and then I'm gonna go, let's go back home and we'll sort out that wild garlic. Ugh, come on. bang up the garlic, wild garlic pesto and the best way to do it, the best way to do it is a, a pestle and mortar because you're not cutting or grinding, you're just you're smushing all the oils out so they sort of cut everything but we start off just a couple of cloves of garlic in there first Smush them up, you can pull the skins out after you've started to smush them up, it's the easiest way. The wild garlic, the ramsons. Now, we've got so much of it, but it soon, it soon breaks down to, to hardly anything. Parmesan. Hazelnuts. Few of them in. Some coarse Himalayan salt. Olive oil just to loosen it up. Chunky pesto on. Have a look. Ooh. Juicy. Yeah, it's a little bit pink in the middle, which is perfect. There we go, lamb on the pesto, so onion, crispy bacon, a couple of little ends for the chef, delicious, look at that, there we are, wild garlic pesto with a lamb steak and onion, that is just keep it simple on that one. Sorry. Mm. Wow. The ultimate guy, that's well garlicky. Wow. Oh. Good job I'm solitary, solitary, solitarily confined. <laughs> smoke a -rooney. that was delicious absolutely delicious i recommend everyone does it it's the time of year for wild garlic it's free it's out there so uh, treat yourself while i was filming my mate uh video called me and so i ended up having a 
a two hour video chat and uh, I lost all my light and I got a bit drunk <laughs> so that was that but thanks for watching take care of each other and most importantly yourselves one love